is an arts hub, mecca of uh, arts activism, of music, of joy, of celebration, of queerness, of expression, of the marginalized. It is this uh, little underground hub that inspires and cultivates artists in the community and gives them a home and a sanctuary where otherwise they would not have. It's beautiful to have a place that feels like a living room, like you're in somebody's like beautiful fairy tale Alice in Wonderland basement. <laughs> It's a big ass little thank you thing for you to be able to like do like the little acrobatic shit on. We have tutus in there. Like we have bow ties and we have like saxophones hanging from the ceilings, like flowers, paintings. Like it's literally screams express yourself in here. Um, I'm Patrick Shepard, AKA Pat Two Dope, P-A-T, the number two, D-O-P-E. Yeah, that's me. You know, you don't feel like you get drowned out in the noise of the world where you go to work, behave this way, this, 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 this. You know, you can actually have a home, have a home base. My name is Alessandra Marim Rosario. I also go by DJ Medusa. So my main role here is a curator. I'm an artist. I use this space as like a studio space, a private place for me to continue to evolve my creativity. Being here and being with the Open Mic Committee has just made me like an all better, more like artist overall. So I'm just grateful and thankful for it. <laughs> My name is Asha Jordan, AKA Jordan Nick Art. I am from Ann Arbor, been here for 30 years, and I'm a visual artist. I can't really paint where I'm at. I can't do a lot of art where I'm at. I'm not in like the best situation, and I don't have like a studio space or anything. So this is amazing. For Ann Arbor, I've been here my whole life. I've never heard of anything like this being here. And my whole thing is this space has brought an opportunity for us to be able to have artists of color come here and do something on this side of town. Carytown was the black side of town and a lot of people don't know that. And everybody mostly got ran out. And I'm just trying to let people know we weren't allowed past here on. So when I did the, the event on Main Street with the Say Yes Fest, that was a big deal. That's never been done. And now we're over here. It's going to be amazing. It's just an amazing opportunity. Yeah, Now Studios is 100% necessary for the community of Ann Arbor. Um, one, for the artist community. Two, for the queer community. And also for all people. When I'm upstairs and outside, I have to hide a little bit. But when I'm down here, I don't have to hide at all. Especially as a queer trans drag artist, that support is something that we need to survive. And that's what they provide for everyone in this space. And it's just amazing. This is the first time I have felt seen in Ann Arbor. I've been here for 31 years, 30, 30 years. They don't care if you're white, black, blue, purple, orange, don't give a damn. If you're a unicorn, it don't matter. Like, you're welcome and you literally feel the love as soon as you walk in. I don't know. I think I'll cry if this place goes away. Party's just fucking started. You ready? Hit that track!